it's still eerily quiet on the front of the media which is consistent with what I was saying about there being another option being pursued in Iran which is the non-military option of what turns out to be sanctions right now which hurts more people than uh, conventional warfare generally speaking um, and it doesn't really it's not as exciting it doesn't hit the media so it's not a bad option if you're trying to uh, <laughs> kill a bunch of people without uh, it being noticed as much because uh, you know we killed at least a half a million people in Iraq before there are bombs falling just through sanctions so there is that I'm hoping I know it's sick but I'm hoping that it stays with the sanctions because I feel that a military confrontation would become a widespread com confrontation that actually killed more people in the long run than the sanctions that themselves did of course I prefer none of the above because I can't think of anything Iran has done to the to the American people and we have no business being over there um, dictating what goes on and we're doing it fully on the behest of Israel which doesn't get discussed anywhere because everybody's afraid politically and influentially in the, you know in the media that they will get trashed and they would they would not rightfully but they would get trashed if they said anything and they know that um, there's, a, there's a lot to unravel with that and I'm not going into it here call me greedy I just want to stay on YouTube and maybe I can get monetized and both of my viewers will make me a one cent per year <laughs> take care